But the big story on Action News tonight is the arrest of a man who allegedly burst into the hotel room of actor Jamie Foxx in Center City, Philadelphia. Police tonight are saying that the suspect tried to force his way into Foxx's room at the AKA Rittenhouse Hotel on South 18th Street, but that Fox fought him off and the intruder fled. Fox has been in Philadelphia for a couple of months filming a movie. Now comes word that the man has been apprehended. Action News reporter Dan Cuellar is live outside the hotel. Dan, you've got the details. Well, Jim, publicists for Jimmy Fox say that everything had been going well here in Philadelphia during the filming of his movie Law Abiding Citizen up until the very end. Just as they were trying to wrap up production here, they say a strange man began to stalk him, pretending to be some hotshot music producer. It all went down here at the AKA Hotel, where actor Jamie Foxx was staying in the penthouse suite. Authorities say that on March 20th, this man, 49-year-old William Brown, AKA Stephen Tolliver, knocked on Foxx's hotel door, claiming to be Beyonce's music producer. Foxx opened the door, authorities say, and Brown tried to push his way into the room. Gripped by fear, Fox tells police he had to struggle to shove the guy out of the room and call the front desk. A security officer found Brown lurking in the penthouse floor and escorted him out of the hotel and told him not to return. Fox, shaken but otherwise unharmed, went on to continue filming of his movie, Law Abiding Citizen, which was being filmed here in Philadelphia at a number of locations. But on March 22nd, police say, the alleged stalker returned to the hotel and was attempting to enter the elevator. When confronted by security, the defendant told them he was going up to see someone. But security officers recognized him and kicked him out, telling him never to return. On Tuesday of this week, Jamie Foxx's security team noticed Brown again entering the AKA hotel and confronted him and called police. Brown tried to get away, but was later arrested at 1200 Art Street. Brown, who identified himself to police as Stephen Tolliver, has been charged with stalking, false impersonating, harassment, criminal trespass, and burglary. He's being held in lieu of $250,000 bail pending his prelim on April 7th. Publicists, meanwhile, say Jamie Foxx wrapped up filming here on Tuesday and is now safe and sound back in Los Angeles. We're live here in Rittenhouse Square. Dan Cuellar, Channel 6 Action News. Thank you, Dan.